Learners in Learning Land, today we're breaking down some ZZ Top five different licks. If you like this kind of content, hit subscribe. If you love it, think about becoming a Patreon and you can score a printable PDF with every single lesson, backing tracks, other goodies, and that starts at just a dollar a month. Links up here in the notes. Additional links in the description, including my email if you want some one-on-one -on -one lessons. Let's do it. Grab the guitar, brain attention span, follow me on in, and let's break these licks on down. All right, so we've got a nice clean tone. No fuzz, nothing like that. They do um, play with a lot of overdrive. Really crank that amp as well too and find that point of crunch. So keep that in mind. If you want to play like ZZ Top, you're gonna need to play loud and overdrive. Now let's go ahead and take a look at our first lick. We're in the key of C minor. Most, if not everything we're gonna do is gonna come from the C minor pentatonic. So we're gonna start off. 11th fret of the B string, bend it up a whole step. So we're bending that B to C. That B flat, excuse me, to C. Now this is shape one, eight, 11, eight, 10, eight, 10, eight, 10, eight, 11, eight, 11. And here on the 11th fret of the B string, you have your flat seven. We're bending up to the root note. So we're in C. We're bending to a C note. That's a classic move that you should really have in the bag. That was a little little wing lick. Um, you should definitely know that shape one, bending into that root, you have that available right there. And that's strong in any kind of style of music. Triplet, eight, 11, eight, E string, B string. Again, 11 pull 8, and then grab the 10th fret. 8, 11, 8. That's our first one. Doo, doo, doo. 11 pull 8, and then grab 10 with your ring finger on the G string. That's our next one. Then we're going to play the 8th fret of the B and the G string with our index finger. Ring finger, 10th fret of the D. Then roll that ring finger over 10th fret of the G, 8, 10. Do, do, do. So this measure, nice and slow. One pola, two pola, three pola, four pola. Roll it back up, then right back down. This is also a C note. So we're resolving this lick on our root note of the key. The whole thing. Two, three, four. All right, very cool. This next lick is a lot shorter and it starts halfway through the measure on the third beat and you're gonna hammer eight to 10 on your A string up to eight and that's a triplet. Three pola and then you're gonna come down to 10 and slide to eight. Grab the sixth fret and then slide eight to 10 on the D string again. So really slowly. Triple it, four and one, two, three, four. Triple it, do, do, do. Triple it, four and one, two, three, four. And you're right there on the root note, right in shape one. Okay, the next lick, third lick, is very similar, but it's a little different. And I think that when you're talking about good phrasing, you should be able to take something that you've already seen and give it new life. Make it just a little different, but the ears, it feels new and familiar at the same time. Okay, so we're going to start off on the and, one, two, and three, then hammer to ten and three, index finger, eighth fret of the D string, and instantly slide on the fourth beat, 10 to eight. One, two, and three, and four, and sixth fret on the and, then we're gonna slide up to 10 two times this time. One and two, one and two, one and two, three, 
one and 10th fret of the D string, drop down to eighth fret of the B here. We're gonna give it like this quarter tone, half tone, three, oh, I'm sorry, two, and then on the third beat, drop down to the 10 again. One and two, three. So we get one, two, and three, and four, and one, and two, three. Now with that bend, you could also grab the A fret of the B string as well, and that sounds really nice. If you wanted to. Okay, now for something completely different. We're gonna do 10 here on the D and then 10 slide 12 on the G. One, well it'd be four and, four and one, four and, four, four and, four and one. Now for something completely different. 10th fret here, do, do, and slide up to the 12th fret of the do, do, G string. 10 on the D, 10 slide 12 on the G. Four and one. Grab the eleventh fret of the B string on the first beat. Do do do. And it's a triplet. Eleven, twelve, eleven. One pola. Then flip that. Twelve, eleven, twelve. Two pola. And then three and four. Down here to the eighth fret here. Four. And what we're gonna do here is four. Do, do, four and a one, four and a one, four and a one, pull eight, ten pull eight to our root. So we, so we get nice and slow. Four and one, pull a two, pull a three and four, e and one. That's kind of hard to count. Four and a one, there we go. Four and a one, four and one, pull a two, pull a three and four and a one. There we go. All right, fifth lick. This one's gonna utilize hammer-ons and pull-offs, and the key here is to get them in the pocket. So we're gonna practice hammering on and pulling off while playing triplets. Eighth fret of the E string, one. Then we're gonna do a triplet that's eight, six, eight, but you're gonna hammer on to the six. So it's two, pull, a three. Sixth fret of the A string, one. Two, pull, a three, pull, a six eight six three pola one two pola three pola one two pola three pola four eighth fret here again on the a string eight pull to six eight and then it's going to slide after that up to ten so that first measure one two pola three pola four pola one okay one pola two, one pola two, eight slide ten, one pola two, one pole eighth fret of the D, tenth fret up here. One pola two, one pola two pola, that's ten, 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 two pola three, four, two pola three, four, two pola three, four, just a quarter bend. And this time we're gonna go ahead and hit both of them. So nice. Okay, so nice and slow. One, two, pola, three, pola, four, pola, one, pola, two, pola, three, four. Let's do it again. One, two, pola, three, pola, four, pola, one, pola, two, pola, three, four. Yeah. Five ZZ Top licks in the key of C minor. Hope you dig. And there you go, folks. Five ZZ Top licks inspired to level up your playing. I hope you dig it. Thank you for rocking and rolling with us. We do new guitar every single Monday. Cheaper than a cheap cheeseburger. Talking about becoming a Patreon. It will level up your playing. Check it out. Links up here in the notes. Um, 
it, it will make you a better player, I promise. Full breakdown to this, plus the theory behind the licks and everything. Take your playing to a whole new level. Also, if you really, really want to hang out, check out my email down there. You can email me for lessons, private lessons, one-on-one. Just got out of the shower. Sorry, I'm still dripping wet. And until next time, catch you next Monday for guitar, Saturday and Wednesday for ukulele. Take care and have a lovely day. Life is good.